right. Uh, hopefully I'm recording. Yes, I am. Now I need to find my controllers and time to play some more Alex. Weird. But I know it doesn't look too dangerous. Okay. Hmm. Well, we're some somewhere. I don't have any of my weapons, so let's look around here. Got some bottles of beer. Ooh, lettuce. Huh. Head of lettuce here. <laughs> we. Okay, uh, ooh, I'm getting a lot of frame drops here. For some strange reason. But, uh, hopefully that'll pass. Again, I'm not running anything, so. Now, internet browser's closed, little Firefox has been closed. It's just recording and the game. And, uh, yet I still get some frame drops. So. Huh. Okay. Well, I mean, there's nothing here for me to uh, pick up, so I guess we'll just move on. Whoa, what is up with these frame drops? This is terrible. Just a second. Okay, seems to have uh, normalized, so keep going. Quick, jump down there. <laughs> no, he can't jump down there. Instant death. Creepy door just locked us in this room here. And uh, this is the exit. So. Ooh, wow. That is a nice looking place you got there. Nice, convenient, opened up a nice path for us. But I just want to see something for a minute. No, that's <laughs> instant death. Okay. So this is where we're supposed to go. Just uh, testing my frame rate here. Seems like it's okay now. Can I have that? You can have it back. I won't. <laughs> Ooh, glasses. Can I wear these? No, I guess not. Well, I already wear glasses in real life, so... <laughs> I don't need to wear an extra pair over my... own. VHS tapes. Oh, AHS. I don't know what AHS stands for. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. You know, I'm so in the habit of searching for things that I know we're not really going to find anything because all my guns are gone, but 
I just really feel like searching drawers and stuff. You know? Ooh. What's this? Oh. No, I want the uh, sleeping bag. <laughs> Alright, well. Hey, what's this? Oh. This is just a rotted fruit. Frying pan? You never know when you might need a weapon. Frying pans are always useful. That's not a good idea. Now, how do I get up with that? <laughs> how do I get upstairs? Okay, well, yeah, no, that, that was a pretty bad idea. I shouldn't have done that. Uh, nope. Maybe over here. Nope. I am stuck down here. That was a bad idea. <laughs> now I'm stuck here. Wait, hold on. Oh, no, get on top of this. Uh... Oh, here we go. Bad. Actually, hold on. There was a ladder... Explore this area a bit. Nope. Oh, that's instant death. Alright, I guess we'll go down. Uh, we're gonna go down this door over here. Oh, it's a bed. That is so trippy. Oh! Okay. Toilet paper. You might need it. that pipe. Oh! <laughs> I forgot this thing's on my face. Alright, let's get out of here. Hmm. No? Oh, over here. I need a weapon.
Get out of here. Door just closed. Get out of here. Ooh, hard hat. Never know in these dangerous situations when you might need a hard hat. Wait, hold on. Nope, does not work. <laughs> Zero out of ten. <laughs> Come on, open the door. I need sustenance. <laughs> All the ashtrays are congregating over there. What about the bread? Oh no. Leave. We must leave. Cool. Okay. What's going on? Oh no! Ooh, slow down. That's a slow down. Come on. Really? Okay. Well. Sure. <laughs> Let's just do a load there. I thought I had a uh, little energy stuff in my hands when I... Oh, whatever. Uh, I thought I was going to make it through that section without dying, but I guess I uh, died, so... <laughs> Okay, then. 
Hey, let me just give this a uh, chance right here to adjust my headset. It's a little heavy on my head. To tighten it a bit. There we go. And then move my glasses a bit. All right. Open the door. Come on. Come on. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, no. Understand. Oh, people over there. Not good, not good, not good. That's all of them. Ooh, lots of slow down here. Lots of floating objects. Not good. Whoa. Any more grenades? Oh. Oh no! <laughs> no! That's bad. I need my uh... Any more grenades. Stay there, please.
Okay, that's good. Okay, good. Huh. We'll see what this uh, mysterious weapon is. After we're done loading. <laughs> oh, man. Way to kill any of the, uh, the uh, tension and the suspense. You know? You're so ready to, to find out what it is, but uh, you gotta wait for this loading screen. Right? Okay, here we go. Gordon Freeman? Gordon Freeman. <laughs> Miss Vance, you wouldn't need all that to imprison Gordon Freeman. So, who are you? Perhaps what I am is not as important as what I can offer you in exchange for coming all this way. Some believe the fate of our worlds is inflexible. My employers disagree. They authorize me to nudge things in a particular direction from time to time. What? what? Would you want nudged, Miss Vance? The Combine off Earth. I want the Combine off Earth. Ah, uh, that would be a considerably large nudge. Too large, given the interests of my employers. Well, you asked. What if I could offer you something you don't? No, you won't. Dad? Dad? What? Is that me? What is this? What's happening? We are in the future. This is the moment where you watch your father die. Unless... What? Unless what? Unless you were to take matters into your own hands. Release your father, Miss Vance. Good. 
as a consequence of your action, this entity will continue, and this entity will not. Right. So, he's okay, right? He lives. My dad lives. You are aware that you've proven yourself to be of extraordinary value. A previous hire has been unable or unwilling to perform the tasks laid before him. We have struggled to find a suitable replacement until now. No! I, I just want to go home. Send me home! I'm afraid you misunderstand the situation, Ms. Vance. Wait! Hey, wait! 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 Oh, well, <laughs> that's the end of the game. Okay, that was pretty cool. <laughs> that was pretty cool leading up to... Oh, the, I like the re... Uh, whatchamacallit? The, uh... Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah, that's that was pretty good. So she's uh, basically replaced uh, Gordon Freeman in stasis. Which is... Um, Pretty cool, you know? Gives us a little hope of Half-Life 3. And uh, hopefully we get like a full PC version of the game. Because that would be really cool. <laughs> oh man, I... Now I just want another uh, Half-Life game. <laughs> Everyone's saying that this is like Half-Life 3. You know, in VR, it's like, no, that's not it. This is just a teaser. This is a, this is a this is a glorified teaser for Half Life Three. Oh man, that's, that's now I want Half Life Three <laughs> even more. Ah, oh, well, you know, this was a good experience. Though. That's very very fun in VR. But uh, yeah, I just uh, man, I wish I had a better computer to uh, experience this. But uh, you know, at least I made it through. It's pretty nice. Cast here. Oh, controllers. Oh, yeah, I really want to have five three now. <laughs> Come on, Valve. For Jake. I don't know who that is. But that's for you. She's gone, Gordon. She's gone. Son of a bitch and his unforeseen consequences. I knew it. When I get my hands on him, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill him. That is so cool. Oh man, now I want a Half-Life 3. A real proper Half-Life 3. And I think that's the, uh, oh. I think that's the end of the game. Right? All right, yeah, we're back in the main menu. And, uh, man, dude. Ah. Oh. Really want a Half-Life 3 now. But I just want to do one thing before I stop this video. Just, uh... Alright. 
Let me just see if I can uh, get into the game here. I'll talk about my thoughts about this. I really want a Half-Life 3. Oh, that, that ending with a whole retcon where Eli uh, is alive. Oh, man. It just, you know, I, I mean, I'm not really into retcons, but, you know, that was a pretty good one. It just, it kind of, you know, it makes sense in this universe of Half-Life that um, you can do that. You know, I mean, I, to me it does. I don't know about anybody else. But that that is a that is a plausible thing to do, you know. Like the G-Man uh, intervenes, and um, yeah, dude, it's it's pretty cool. But yeah, you know, I mean, that just opens up a whole new kind of thing. Uh, new, you know, with a with a plot, which is uh, what everybody's been waiting for. I, can I do this? Press trigger to start. All right, I just want to do one thing before I stop recording. Uh, can I skip this? Oh, we gotta, we gotta watch this whole thing again. Want to do one thing before I stop? I'm probably gonna play this game over again just to try to get some of the other achievements. But, um, yeah, no, I mean, uh, as far as I can, uh, as far as my personal opinions about this game, it's pretty good. You know, this, this showcases, uh, uh, what VR could be, you know, and, uh, yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> it's what a AAA studio can do with VR, you know? you know, other studios could learn from this. All right. Right, I'm here. Can I move now, please? I want to do something. Can I move? Oh, here we go. Oh, nope. Alan! How's it looking up there? It's good, Dad. Metrocop movement is normal. Same for the combine patrols. How's it going in the stockyard? <laughs> One combine mini reactor from a shipment of 4,000. They're never going to miss it. Here, see for yourself. <laughs> Don't do that. Someone's got to the combine construction network. Don't get greedy, guys. <laughs> We're not made of time here. One minute and I'm out. Guaranteed. Oh, I don't know what else I can write here. The combine moving supplies into the quarantine zone. That place has been deserted for years. Hmm. That is all. Well, well, we'll look into it when we get back. What is it? Meet back at the safe house, baby. We'll be there soon. It looks like. What is it, Rusty? Would you? Terrific. Well, this is not the thing I was trying to do. Hold on. I need to do one one last thing before I finish the game. Okay, nope, that's not what I want. Get over here. Ah, here we go. This is what I want to do. All right, how do you feed these? Uh, feed this thing. Yeah, let's feed the snark. This little guy deserves a little meal before uh, I stop playing the game for today. Because I forgot to feed him the first time I played. And, uh, yeah. That's about it for today. That's Half-Life Alex, the whole game. I don't need to do that. Hold the toggle the game menu. But, uh, yeah, like I said, it's, it's a really good, uh, really good VR game. It is the gold standard when it comes to like triple A uh, VR in general. All, you know, other studios need to need to uh, take a look at this game and you know learn some lessons from it. But uh, you know, you don't need a simple VR port of an existing game. You can create something entirely new and pretty good, at least in my opinion. So yeah, that's. 
that's it for today. I'm just gonna go find a seat here. Let me get let me grab a chair. Hopefully I can sit down where my actual chair is in real life. Oh, that was Hey, well, I'm sort of close, but yeah. Alright, that's about it for today. I'll see you guys with another game next time.